Okay, so we're getting ready to get right into this tutorial. What I'm gonna do is start with my Jacqueline Hill palette and I am getting ready to grab the color, yes, and you guessed it, in light. <laughs> I've really been feeling that color as a eyebrow bone highlight. So, and we are going to highlight the eyebrow bone. And by the way, I have already prepped my eyelids and I have done my eyebrows off camera. So if you would like to see my eyebrow routine, my routine pretty much stays the same. It's just now my products are changing only because I am experimenting, trying to see what works for me and trying to see what I like, what's the better fit for me. So, but the routine itself is the same. And by the way, thank you so much for visiting my channel and clicking on this video. And it'll be so greatly appreciated if you would go ahead and like and subscribe once you see the overall and you like what you see go ahead and subscribe girl <laughs> and then first what I am going to go in with a transition color and the color that I am going to start with is this mauve color right here and I believe this color is called bun you can see that good we are going to complete our transition with that shade. Going into the Juvia's Masquerade palette, I am going to go ahead and next go into the color Bori, which is this shade here, and I am going to pop that also right above the crease. I am going into the color Zobo and I am also applying that right above the crease. Back with that previous brush, making sure that we don't lose the color Bori. <laughs> going back into the Jaclyn Hill palette, I am going to grab the shade Color Pop. I mean, Soda Pop. What is wrong with me? <laughs> and I am going to pop that on the outer corner. Next, what I'm going to do is go ahead and do a half cut crease using my NYX eyeshadow base in the color white. And going back into the color Coke Soda Pop, I'm going to go ahead and I am going to blend in. Now 
next I'm going to go on ahead and set in the where I cut the crease with the color MFCO out of the Jaclyn Hill palette. It was off camera. I applied the glitter line and my falsies off camera. So with this, I, I'm going in with my duo brush on adhesive with vitamins. And I am going to, like you would normally do with your eyeliner, this is what we're going to attempt with the glitter line. As soon as I found my mirror. Next we are going in with my e.l.f. cream liner and what I am just going to do is darken up my waterline and also um, in case of you're wondering the glitter that comes from Bano brushes and this is their rose gold metallic glitter and that's what I use to line my eyes just FYI Next, I am getting ready to go ahead and go over my lashes, uniforming them with my falsies with my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. Now what I am going to go ahead and do is finish the rest of my face. And I will be right back okay guys so this is the final look um, I hope you guys really enjoyed it I'm just wearing kind of like a a shirt robe type of thing I'm trying to think where did I get this from Rue 21 they had it on a clearance ooh, ooh, ooh. So I think I paid like no more than seven dollars for it and a little necklace and some nice little rose gold earrings to match to really bring out that glitter and yeah this is the final look i hope you guys really enjoyed this tutorial i think it came out beautifully i think it came out very classy like and i, I really love this look all together you know it just it looks mature it looks 
you know, it looks classy, but then it looks like, you know, you like to enjoy yourself at the same time. So, thank you so much again for tuning into it video i love you guys so dearly don't forget to like comment below some colors that you'll like to see me play with or some palettes you'll like to see me play with and share the video of course spread the word this is something that i am passionate about that i finally got up the nerve to kind of like come outward like i love makeup i love makeup so <laughs> I thank you guys so much and don't forget to click that subscribe button and once you hit that subscribe button hit that bell so you don't miss any notifications or any um, videos from me and I love you guys from the bottom of my heart until next time peace <laughs> bye